Cyber School Media. What's up, guys? It's your boy Thundarius. Great. And we're coming at you live from Cyber School HQ. So we've got a little different format for you guys today. We're going to try it out and see if we like it. And we're back with our hot stuff. Uh, what do we got today, Shades? Um, something that um, took out one of our guys. <laughs> oh, no. We've yeah, got, we got more popcorn. We've got Crude's arch nemesis, spicy yeah. popcorn. <laughs> so what we've got here today is some sunrisers popcorn sunrisers gourmet popcorn they are located in clarinda iowa so they are a local local establishment Ooh, that's close to us and uh i've had some other popcorn before it was absolutely delicious so got these as a gift we've got three kinds and we're gonna see how they taste we're gonna see if they're up to snuff with the spice then we're gonna see if we uh recommend it for you guys and in what capacity our first bowl of popcorn called ghost flames and i would assume it's got ghost pepper in it so what do you think shades uh, i think it's time to eat that's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's do this. Takes it a second. But it, but it, it kicks in. And, uh, I don't know, cheesy-ish something. And then heat. That's pretty good, though. So it's definitely delicious. I don't know if I'm right, but yeah, it tastes more like a cheddar or some sort of cheese. Yeah. And uh, it's got a little kick. I think most people would be fine eating this popcorn. Yep. But the longer you eat it, um, uh -oh. it gives you a little more kick. The cat's gonna have fire butthole. Uh oh. Yeah, there's a little bit of heat there when you kind of let it sit right in the back of your throat. Overall, it's good. I think we could do this for movie night real easy. Real easy. For sure. If you got someone who likes a little kick, they'll enjoy this. If you're really sensitive to heat, you probably won't like it. Because for us, it's like maybe like... Maybe like a 2 on a scale of 1 to 10. If we had a scale. I'd go with 2. That sounds pretty good. So, it may have ghost pepper in it, but not enough that it's gonna kill you. I think the ghost pepper popcorn that we had that destroyed crude um, was a little spicier than this. Yeah. This is kind of uh, family friendly. Very family friendly. That's a great good approach. You want a little kick? This is for you. All right, let's go on to the next. Good stuff. All right, so we've got our next one, and the next one called Creeper. The Creeper. The Creeper. The Reaper. Ooh. So I'm guessing it's got some Carolina Reaper, and that it might creep up on you. Reaper! Reaper! So caramel or caramel. Yeah, it looks like. It looks like caramel corn. Caramel corn. Yeah, it looks just like regular caramel yeah. corn. But yeah, just, I, I got a bad feeling. I have a bad feeling about this. Maybe not a bad feeling, just a, uh, yeah. All right, let's do this. All right, so that's delicious. That is the first thing I'm gonna say. Sure. A 
I'm still waiting for it. Oh my. Anything? I feel like it's maybe starting to bring back the heat from the last one, but nothing. It feels nothing, very similar yeah. to the last one. Yeah, nothing crazy. So again, another very family friendly popcorn. It's probably. I'm going to just take a wild guess and say this is going to be my favorite one of the batch, though. I think I'm confusing this one's heat with the last one's heat. I think they're probably about the same. Yeah. Because now I'm starting to get a little heat again. Just a little. I would definitely put it on par with the last one. Sure. But I'm a sucker for some good caramel corn. Yeah. Back of your throat. <laughs> <laughs> that is delicious. I highly, highly recommend this for movie night. There I concur. Go. Good stuff. So yeah, we said Sunrisers popcorn based out of Corn, Iowa. And uh, really good. I wonder what other flavors they have. Maybe we'll look that up. Yeah. But, all right, well, I think that's on to the next one then. Action. And we're back. So. Everybody knows there's no challenge associated with this. If Sunrisers wants to come up with a sweet challenge for spicy popcorn and make one that... If they think they got got what it they takes. Do, they want to make something that might put a little hurt on you. Oh, yeah! But, uh... Put some hair on your chest. <laughs> <laughs> but we are cleansing our palates between each, each one just so we can get a better idea of how strong each one might be. That's that. He's cheap. I'm not. Stop lying, Shades. No, I'm kidding. I'm drinking some. The last one we've got is called Buffalo Reaper. I'm uh, thinking it's cheddar again. It's the same color as the other one, as the ghost flame. Yeah. But hopefully, well, it says buffalo. So probably got a little cheddar, a little buffalo. Buffalo chicken. Yeah. And we all know how much Shades loves buffalo chicken. Yeah. yeah. Chicken in general. All right, well, here we go. Last one. You ready, Shades? Bottom, bottoms oh. up. I taste the cheese. I taste a little bit of buffalo. Very cheesy. I can do good. Yeah. Again, spice is very tame. If you want to flex on someone, I'm like, hey, I mean, Carolina Reaper popcorn. Send them a picture of this, unless they know about how unspicy it is, and then the, then they're gonna make money. But it's very delicious. All right. The flavors overall were great. Sunrisers, Sunrisers knows how to make good popcorn. I'll I'll give it that. And I'm done. I actually think this one was a little more tame than the other two. To be honest, I would have to agree. Unless it starts sneaking up here. Nothing crazy. Very good popcorn. Like, I definitely want to get a bunch of this for, like, movie nights and stuff. Yeah. That'd be great. Yep. It's something about anybody can eat. Okay, there's a little heat. There's a little heat. Okay. It's about the same. They're all three about the same, I would say. Um, did you have a, a favorite shades? Um, number two. The, the caramel... Yep. Creeper. Sure. So, ding, ding, ding. This is the winner. I didn't know there was a competition, but Creeper won. No. The flavors. The flavors are great. Absolutely phenomenal. The spice, if you're chasing something spicy and you've got a high spice tolerance, probably not what you're looking for. Yeah, you're going to be let down if you're expecting it to get you in the butthole. But if you're looking for a nice popcorn with a little zing, for a movie night or you know pick it up grab it eat it i think there's gonna be kids who can eat this too probably i wouldn't like give it to real young children obviously but there's some kids who could probably eat this just fine so it's a very family friendly popcorn great great term shades yeah you got anything else to say about this amazing popcorn from sunrisers uh i want more please sir I want some more. More? All right, stop it. Stop it right there. Now go on, fill up the bowl. Go 
gone. That's it. What more? Well, the good thing is we've got all of this right back behind us. And we're going to eat all of it. So if you've got something spicy you want us to try, whether you're local or you just found something online, send it our way. We'll eat it on camera. Give you our thoughts. Anything else? Oh, smash that like button. Go and subscribe. Hello.